Alright, welcome back to Cynic Placebo's Halloween Marathon. I'm showing this title because uh, I didn't know exactly what this word meant, but gynophobia means an extreme fear or dislike of women. And that is this weird Steam game here. It's only got 556 reviews, so let's see if this is a hidden gem that's not well known, or if it's just a stinker. You never really know with these sorts of indie titles. Sometimes they're awful little passion projects, and sometimes, you know, they're well done. Alright. Game designer and independent developer. Just what we want. I do like looking for these, you know, hidden gems. Sometimes, again, you bump into just some horrible games, but sometimes it is excellent. Alright, new game. Gynophobia. Music seems okay. So far, the art style seems okay. Let's give it a go. Hopefully, it'll teach me the key bindings and I don't need to learn them. Alright, we've got... Ooh, let's turn that sensitivity down, shall we? Uh, options... Sensitivity way down. There we go. Now let's try a new game. That's a little better. That way I won't make you seasick. Okay, so we got crows at the window. Oh, knocking over brooms. F to use. Uh, okay, I hit F. Why does mom read this book? Can I crouch? Okay, I can crouch. Can't open these though. Alright, it's not a toggle. Interesting decoration on the bed. Interesting artwork in general around here. Somebody's uh, very into the classics. Let's see. Okay, can't open these. F to use the bra, right? Nope. Okay, can't do that either. Anything on here? What's this say? Gynophobia is an abnormal fear of women. Well, maybe I didn't need the dictionary definition at the front after all. That would have... Told me what I needed to know. Oh, we got a spider. Can I kill it? Oh, I'm scared of spiders, it looks like. Okay. So I can't go by the spiders. What about here? No? I mean, this seems like arachnophobia, not gynophobia. Alright, let's get in here. Away from the spider. Demon spider. Shadowy peak, huh? Press enter to play. Yeah, come on. Let's game it out. <laughs> oh, funny. Okay, so this is literally me joining a video game within the video game. Clever. Fun. Alright. I have weapons with one, two, and three. Uh, it looks like I don't have a three yet, so I've just got a pistol and a knife. Well, let's start out with a knife. Why not? Okay. Ooh, now we got some ammo for the pistol. Alright. Can I turn off my flashlight? Doesn't look like it. Alright, so the knife does swing a little slowly. Not too bad, but a little bit. Alright, so we got some zombies, it looks like. Let's try a headshot, see what that does. Ooh, they're quick. Whoa! Yeah, they're very quick. Holy crap! Maybe I should have gone for stealth. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, maybe stealth is the way to go. <laughs> that was tough. Maybe I can just run past them? Alright, let's see if we can plot a course. That side seemed a dead end. Let's check this side. Can't go that way. There was ammo over there, though, so let's go get the ammo, huh? I mean, the aesthetic seems okay. The sounds... Sounds are very broad, like... So when I, uh... Tried to do it initially, I had to turn it down because just the music in the intro was so loud. But now this seems a lot quieter. Here we go... Again, I'm not sure why they chose to call it gynophobia, but maybe later that will become apparent. Oh, they're all in there, huh? Okay, what's this? Health? Alright. So far, so good. Well, it's just a little zombie shooter. It's okay. I like the speed of the zombies. I like that they're scary and that they charge you. They make okay noises, too. 
Could use a little more ammo, but there's some. Can I loot this guy? No such luck, huh? Okay. The aesthetics are very... I don't know what to say. I mean, it's not quite Half-Life. It's its after 1998's Half-Life. I'd say I'd say it's somewhere in the ballpark of 2002. Alright, so headshots do matter if you can manage to get them. They're just a little bobby, and so it's hard to get the headshot exactly because they bob back and forth. But I'm starting to get the hang of how to time it. Alright, what's back here? And even these just uh, you know basic maze puzzles of... Of stairways winding around. That's fun too. The ominous eerie music bids me to continue. Alright, nothing here. Okay, I don't need the health. But I will take ammo. Okay. Just kind of working my way back towards this back corner. So the back of the head doesn't count as a headshot. That's interesting. Oh, he turned right as I went. Oh, we got a crawler. That's very, very Half-Life. Yeah, this definitely was influenced by Half-Life. But, then again, what FPS wasn't, you know? Half-Life was a game changer. Game critics still talk about 1998 as being a pivotal year for gaming just because of all the changes that came on account of Half-Life. Alright, can I use this laptop? Doesn't look like it. I don't need the health. Sounds like someone's coming to get me, but I don't hear them. Just the music was seeming to indicate that. Alright, I'm going to try to... Nope. I was going to try to shoot him in the back of the head, or knife him in the back, but I was too slow. Oh man, I missed. Wasting these headshots. I should, I should be hitting them, but... Oh, can't quite make that jump. Can I make it from here? Oh, come on. Ha 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 ha. You thought you were going to make me go around? I say nay. I go how I want. Okay. There's a ladder there. Assuming that'll lead us up to the next level. Anything over here? I mean, these little side rooms are good for looting, and I will always take some extra ammo. It doesn't look like there's been many zombies in the side rooms, though. Which is a little anticlimactic, if you ask me. Actually, is it climactic or climatic? Comment down below if you know. I think, let's see. Climax, climate. So it'd be climactic, right? I don't know. I'm not sure. But if there's one thing you can be sure of, it's that someone on YouTube will correct your grammar. Alright, nothing in here. What do we have? Uh, I mean, I guess it's time to get wet, huh? Can I make that jump, really? Ooh. I got some mad hops. Oops, and then I fall. Still though, that the fact that I can make those jumps at all shocks me. I didn't I didn't think that was remotely within the realm of possibility. Alright, let's try going up here. Level two. I mean I want to go far enough that I get an idea as to why it's called gynophobia. Oh, let's let's deal with the little guys, huh? So far, I'm not making a dent on that guy, it seems like. Oh, wait, what? what? Reload. Okay, didn't automatically reload. Interesting. Alright, we'll reload again. Thought I left some ammo here, you know? Not the case. Well, let's get the health. I don't know how much the health does, but... Can I just go around behind? <laughs> Ring around the rosy. Take that. Oh yeah, stand right there. Perfect. Yes. Oh. I didn't think he could go under there. I mean, he's slow. I kind of want to see what happens when I let him hit me. Maybe he's impervious and I'm just wasting bullets for no reason and I have to, like, move onward and find a different weapon. 
Because, I mean, it did say one, two, three for weapons, and I've only got the two so far. And he is really slow, so he's not really much of a threat, so I guess I can explore. And, I mean, looks male, so I shouldn't have an irrational fear of him in gynophobia, right? Okay. Anybody back here? Doesn't look like it. Oops, wasted that. Hey, okay, I got a better weapon now. Uh, I've only got 60 ammo, but I guess if I'm going to waste it, I might as well waste it on him, right? Okay. Can he come through here? Zombie, we're going to eat you. No, he can't come through here. Okay, so this is a little safe area. It doesn't seem like I'm even hitting him. It looks like those dots are in front of his head. Maybe we'll save the rest of those bullets since it doesn't seem like I'm effectively doing anything. Let's look and see if we can find a rocket launcher. Rocket launchers always kill things, right? And that's just health. Whew. I don't want these little ones to swarm me, so I want to keep them keep them cold. Ugh. Man, I missed. Alright. Gotta cull the population from time to time. Hey, there we go. Oh, I thought that was another gun. Alright. Anything over here? Hey, there's something. Press F to drop. Is this like a landmine? Let's put it right there. No, I, I thought maybe it was a landmine, but why would I need to gather that? Is there a purpose? Is there something I could put it inside of? Like it doesn't go on top of here. I came out of there, right? Mm, anything on the side of the building? Some ammo. That's always good. Hey, some ammo for a different kind of gun. Oh, but I can't. Oh. Wow, that insta-killed me. Restart, you have to start, okay, good. Whew, I thought I had to start, like, from the beginning. All right. All right, let's leave this guy behind, and let's kill some, some of the basic zombies real quick here. Oh, I reloaded at a bad time, there we go. Okay, so far so good. Oh, wait, can I hop up here and hop out? Yeah, I can. Nice. Alright, I haven't explored this corner yet. Don't need the health at the moment. <laughs> Please be safe. I'm trying to be safe. Well, nice to know that it's that forgiving about headshots. That was more like a chin-neck shot, and it still worked. So what would this be for? Am I trying to, like, put it on a car? Is there a, a, a car that seems more functional than other cars? I mean, this one seems not functional, right? Oh, I can't drop it. Come on. There we go. Alright, so it looks like I just gotta avoid the big guy. Oh, I gotta reload. Ooh, they all swarmed. I was not doing a good job taking them out. Alright, so I've got a tire over there. Oh wait, I didn't get the other gun, did I? That was back over here, right? There we go. Yeah, it seems like the ammo for this gun is the red one. So the question is, can I get it before he gets back? Because I'm assuming he just killed me, right? Like he stepped on me or something, or hit me? I didn't really see, but... If I can get this fast enough. I don't want to get that, but, you know. Health is full. Nice. There we go. Oh, whoops. Well, that was some wasted bullets. Alright. Where to to get that tire? There was... I mean, what car am I fixing? That's got to be the what I'm doing, right? It certainly seems like that would be the reasonable thing. 
All right, which car seems the best? Is that health or is that ammo? That's health. I mean, that one seems good, but... Oh, no, it's a little little messed up. Oh, it looks like E works, too. All right, or maybe I nicked F and didn't pay attention. All right, well, I don't want to go on that car. That one doesn't seem good. Have I been back here? I don't think I've been back here. There we go. Alright, another health back here. Some more ammo. I don't want to get cornered, though. Whew. Cut that a little close, but that's alright. Alright, I've got the wheel. And the other wheel I left near that beater. Where would this go, is the question. Does it go on this boy? Well, I mean, there's another wheel here. Where where would I take the wheels? That is the question. Because it just said F to drop, and it doesn't really seem to go on there. So what vehicle has a chance of being repaired? Is it that van? I guess the van's up on blocks, isn't it? It just looks so damaged. Oh, some ammo here. I'll grab that while we're here. Can I not get it when I'm carrying the tire? Oh, I'm full. I can only have 100 bullets. Okay. Alright, well, this one's up on blocks, so let's see if it will go on this one. I need a toolbox. Ah, okay. Well, at least we found where it goes now. Okay, so we're looking for a toolbox. And then we got to get all the tires here. I thought I saw a toolbox somewhere, but I just didn't realize what it was. I think it was in an alley, wouldn't it? Alright, we got this one here. Let's just throw him... Actually, I can just walk right past this guy. I don't need to, like, play Ring Around the Rosie. Can I throw it over the fence? Yeah, I can. Woo! Ouch. Oh, dang. Alright, I was a fool. I was a fool. Got cocky. Alright, so since 100 is all I can carry, I don't want to be getting ammo unless I'm actually down, because otherwise maybe I'm picking it up and actually getting, like, a couple bullets from my not-quite-full gun. Alright, let's get the gun. Ooh, whoa, alright. There they are. Everybody found me. Wow, I can't hit that guy. Okay. All right. Got to play it safer because that guy one one hit kills. Oh, I'm so slow with the tire. Doesn't seem like it should be, but okay. Ring around the rosy. Be nice if there was another entryway to this gate. I know there's another exit because I can jump up and over, but. So far, so good. I'm going to make it tell me that I need a tool. Okay. Just hopefully that way when I get the tool. Sometimes in games you can't pick something up until you know that you need it, right? I don't know if that's what this one's going to be, but, you know, just in case, might as well. Okay. Any toolbox back here? Doesn't look like it. Oh. That one was sneaky, hanging out in the corner. Oh. oh. Alright, let's keep moving. Ah! And then maybe jump. That scream was like right in my ear. Alright. Okay, he's got to be on my tail by now. Yeah, there we go. Alright, I think I left a tire back there, but we're going to grab this one first. Try to just chuck him up and over. There we go. Then we'll go across this playground. Can I go across the playground or do I get stuck? Like, I assume I can jump over the fences. Yeah, I can. That's fine. Oh, I already got this one. Whoops. I need to pay attention to where I've been, huh? 
All right, let's call the herd again. All right, so far so good. Now, I left a tire back over this way, and we need to keep our eyes out for a toolbox. There wasn't one in here, was there? No, just some ammo, but, you know. Oh, I should get some health. I didn't realize I got so hurt. Let's grab the one from this corner, because I don't like how I get pinned in this corner, so we might as well clear this guy out, because he's less useful than the other spots. Oh, come on, get the health. Hey, there was a toolbox. Oh, and of course, now I'm pinned. Alright, I'm gonna try to run out of here because I don't want to get pinned. Alright, since I've got the toolbox, let's head this way because I think I left a... Which of moves it? A tire over here by this car. What? Man, I missed her way more than I should have. You know, it's a good thing that all these tires have, you know, universal lug nut fittings, because, uh, I would have thought, you know, having had to replace tires recently and get special ones just... Whoa! No! Three health! Wow! That's not good. I got wrecked. I shouldn't have been talking so much, but... Point is, <laughs> tires don't all fit on everything. Alright, there's health here. Let's go up and over and get some more health. Let's fill up our ammo while we're at it. Sure. Oh, no, come on. Wow. That's a little harder to get out of than I thought. Alright, was there health here? That's right. Okay, now we're full. Alright, I've got the toolbox. I assume Mr. Man is playing Ring Around the Rosie trying to get me. Is he going to come this way? Okay, so he's coming from that way. I could use a little more ammunition, but uh, is it enough to go out of my way? Probably not. Yeah, he just walks that way. I forgot. For some reason, I was thinking he had to go around the playground, but he does not. Uh, you know, just for the next level, let's try to get this. There we go. Alright, let's put this on. Nice. And this one on. Nice. Where's the last one? It's got to be around here somewhere. Didn't I throw it? Oh, it's right there next to it. Alright, quick ring around the rosy. Running, running, running. Make sure he comes this way, because I don't want him to double back when I get on the other side. Alright, so far so good. The last wheel's right there. Alright, we'll pick this guy up and then we should be good to go. Come on, pick him up. Why can't you pick him up? Come on! Come on! There we go, we're stuck on something. The van needs fuel. Oh, of course it does. Did I see a gas can? Goodness gracious, where would that have been? I need to pay more attention. There's not like that many assets here. Alright, which way is he gonna go? This way? Yeah, come around this way, dude. Okay. I mean, this game's a little slow, but I'm, I'm enjoying it. It's... I don't know. I, I don't know how to quantify it just yet. Like... It's, it seems to be an okay indie game. I'll be curious to see what else it has to offer. And part of that's going to come down to what the heck it means by gynophobia, right? Like, I don't know. Some of these games, I've definitely played some games on Steam that just felt like they were actually gynophobic. And that's not what I'm hoping for. Alright, let me put the gas in. Alright, can I go now? Sweet. Well, there you go. The end? What? Oh, okay. Well, I mean, that's the end of this little mini-game. So why did I play that? Was that just to make the next event, event trigger? 
Linda said that you were visiting psychiatrist, and the fact that you didn't communicate with the woman co with women was caused by phobia, similar to your spider phobia. Ah, so I also have arachnophobia. Uh, thank God for that, because I was sure that you were gay and that this is something they don't cure nowadays. Oh, right. That's uh, weird, Dad. But, you know, I guess you get to be weird. Uh, how do we go back? There we go. Okay. Um, sorry, I gotta check text meshes in real life. I think my wife is pinging me. Okay, let me see here. Shadow Peak. Somebody ring the bell. We should head that way, I guess. Oh, I'm still scared of spiders, but I don't see where it is. Oh, that's that room again. Where's the front door? Alright, can I throw something at it? Let's see here. Um... I... Don't see what to grab. Can't throw my phone at it. Can't throw a book at it. There's got to be something I can pick up, right? Come on, anything. All it needs is one little toss. So I want to answer the front door, but I'm too scared to go next to it. And I can't grab anything from these shelves. Come on, shoe. Definitely, shoe. Come on. Also, who has spiders that big just walking around in their house? Okay, can I jump up on top of the table? Nope. Potion. Okay. Can I make a potion? Can I pick up the broom? Nope. 666, 33, the Masonic, Masonic symbol and the Illuminati signal. Alright, uh, that's interesting. Okay, can't pick up any of this stuff, huh? Well, I'm not sure what to do if I can't pick something up. Can't go through this door. Can I look? Oh, okay. Alright, so now I'm terrified on this side and the other side, okay? Because there's a spider, too. Alright, so now is the spider less scary? Oh, the spider moved. Alright. We just needed to trigger an event where the spider moves. What could I do in here? Well, for being a game within a game, I think that that last game was sufficient. So the question is going to be whether or not this game is fun. But so far, it's been a little clunky. Hard to tell what to do. Oh, there's something. What does it say? Drink this, mom. Okay. <laughs> I feel sleepy. Oh, so my mom makes potions, and I take the potions, and then... Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Well, that's an effectively awful ugh, visual effect. I don't like that one bit. Oh, it didn't keep the ammo. I was hoping it would. Okay. Is that a mannequin or a real enemy? That's the question. Let's find out. Whoa. All right. Real and creepy. Well, I definitely like how creepy that was. Let's heal up, huh? Alright. I mean, very low poly, but that can still be effective, especially in a horror game. Kind of adds to the surreal nature of it. Whoa, what? How many bullets did those take? Wow. Can I kill those ones? Should I kill those ones? Let's, let's see... Ah, uh, one of nine eggs. Okay. Ah, uh, what? Come here. Oh, did that come out of the egg? Alright, so we gotta kill the eggs. Got it. Ooh, cool writing on the wall. No spider came out of that one. Okay. Man, I don't have much ammo. I need to find ammo. Oh, there's some ammo. I guess I do have the other gun, huh? Okay, so I've got 60 of this. That's that's a decent chunk of ammo. As long as I don't spam the automatic. Oh. Oh, nice. Very creepy. Oh, no. I'm stuck. Alright. It doesn't automatically reload. I hate that. Come on, 
every game nowadays, if you run out of bullets in the mag, it's got to automatically reload. That's that's the rules. All right, you you get the knife. Whew, man, I hope there's some health around because I just wasted a bunch of ammo. Okay, I also need some health. That's three eggs. All right. And the music's definitely louder on this level than it was on the last level. Which justifies how low I set it originally. <laughs> What's that say at the bottom? P. Schmidt, maybe? Sh Sh I can't tell for sure what that says. Alright. Can I kill this spider? Oh, I can. Okay, so five bullets to kill a big spider. Ooh, okay. I could use the health. Alright, that was maybe a waste. I should have gone for the bullet, but I'm just so low on bullets, I, I'm worried about wasting them. Okay, nothing over here, but I went to four eggs. Nothing over here. Well, let's go back in this corner. Alright, I gotta focus on headshots again, because I've been wasting too much ammo. Alright, five eggs. Six eggs, three more. Alright. We at least got some ammo. Now we're doing alright. Whoa. Oh, what's on me? Little bugger. Okay. So far so good. Was there one left? I thought there was one more. You know, the pathways in here are pretty decent. They've been able to track me well around objects and stuff. Ooh, gold. Ow! Come here. Oh, dang it. Normally those little ones don't hurt me. As long as I go fast enough. What is this? Oh, you get ammo out of those. Okay, well time to shoot those guys. Yeah, look at that! Alright, now I've got lots of ammo. Sweet, one more egg. All I need is one more egg. Well, this one went a lot faster than the last one. The last one I was just confused for a while. I didn't realize I had to be assembling a car. Ah, uh, there's the one. But first, let's get that. And then we'll get it. Alright. Now, do I just phase out? Or, oh, now there's a big bad, huh? Alright, who's the big bad? That's the question. And where are they coming from? And, oh! Alright, we're gonna go full auto. Alright, nothing doing yet. There we go. I think I'm almost done with this level, so let's just kill everything, huh? Let's use all my ammo. Okay. Who's next? What's up here? Anything good? Oh. Ow. Ow! Oh, no, no, no! Oh, no! There must have been one behind me! No! I have to start over? You are kidding me. Oh, okay. Well, if it weren't for the fact that we still haven't figured out really why this game's called Gynophobia, I think I would quit here, but let's let's keep going just a little longer. See if we can figure out what's still to do. This time I'll try to be a little more cautious. I was a little devil may care last time. All right. So far so good. Get my ammo. Okay.
You know, I wonder if I should be shooting the spiders in the abdomen. Oops. Alright. Hmm. Oh, trying to go faster this time, but... Trying to just truck through really quickly and find everything. Oh man, I'm already hurt. Alright. I gotta be more careful. Gotta be more willing to use ammunition, I guess. There we go. Alright. I wish I could change that from automatic fire to, like, burst fire or single fire or something, but... Alright, where are we at? Four of nine? Five more. Let's figure out what I've missed. Little turned around, but that's alright. Let's get this. And that. And that. Yeah, it's got to be really, really light touch, and then I can do single fire mode. I just have to pay attention and actually do it. Alright. Alright, two more. Got plenty of ammo, at least for now. Oh, there was one there? Little guy. Alright, so far so good. Switch back to pistol. Heal up. Get some more ammo. Alright, there's one more. Alright, we're in good shape. Alright. We'll shoot this big baddie. Alright, light touch to kill the last few. Alright, now let's see if we can be careful. Oh man. I don't need health. There's a guy in here. Not sure what that's about. But uh oh, I'm stuck. I'm st oh wow, I was stuck in something. Am I supposed to kill him? Well, let's try. Why not? Not sure if that's what I was supposed to do, but you know. Felt like it. Okay. Okay, got some health here if I need it. What do we got? What do we got? Make sure no one's coming up behind me. Check my corners. I mean, I'm starting to like this game, guys. This is seeming like a hidden gem from the, you know, the mechanics and stuff. It just is it's doing well. I'm a little confused from time to time, but that's never lasted too long. The retro aesthetic, I like, okay. The creepy aesthetic's been pretty good as well. Uh, but I do get I do get stuck from time to time. Like right now, I'm not exactly sure what they want me to do, which is not my favorite. Oh, uh, okay. I have a head. Am I supposed to sacrifice it somewhere? Why would I want a head? Was there... There wasn't like a mannequin body anywhere to put it on, right? Oh, I lost it. Come here. I will say that the grab and use keys have not been my favorite. They've been a little bit wonky. All right. What do you think I should do with the head? Just set it here, maybe? Here, birdies. Come have a head. I don't want it to roll off, though. No! Don't fall! Okay, let's crouch. 
There we go. Oh, there we go. I didn't even look up there. Oh, nice. Okay. Again, like I was confused, but that's a reasonable th thing that I'd been confused about. They had established the precedent that sometimes there are things on the roof. Uh, I'm just going to throw that. Oh, I hope I didn't need that. Okay. Whew. Oh, interesting. I thought it was going to go back to real life. But we're still in the game world. Okay. And I'm almost full on pistol ammo, so I'm, I'm focusing on that for now. Alright, interesting. Now maybe we find why this game's called Gynophobia. Ooh, like little radioactive spider things. Oh, can I not hit it from that far? Ooh, she's got a syringe in her eye. I hadn't noticed that before. Syringe right up the eye. Look at that. Ooh, oh, yuck. Okay. Nothing over here. Let's go across. All right. Health. I actually don't need the health, so we'll leave it there. Alright. I mean, as long as they move predictably like that, that's not going to be a problem. But if they start zig zigzagging around, that's where things are going to get difficult. All right, I think I'm full maybe on both ammo. So let's uh, do a little of this guy. Gotta get a reload automatically, or not automatically, manually. That's the opposite of automatic. Alright, I should go back to being cautious because I just blew through a lot of ammo. Ooh, that was weird. Very glitchy. But the fact that glitches aren't the norm, the fact that glitches are, you know, uncommon, means that this game's actually doing pretty well. Alright, let's go right first. Follow the right wall. That was a good choice because I got some good ammo. And then, that's where I came from. So yeah, let's keep going on the right wall. Alright. Yeah, as long as I keep my eyes open, so far nothing has been too unfair. It's it's all had a decent amount of time to come for me. Ooh, that was good though. I mean, again, it wasn't unfair. It was, you know... Oh, yeah, see, that's where it gets hard. Okay. So as long as I kill those things early on, it's fine. But if I wait too long, man, they get hard to kill because they bob all around. Alright, health. I don't see any ammo. So far, so good. Uh-oh. Little radioactive spiders. Alright, I think the other one's full now, so I'm going to switch. Uh-oh. Oh, let me out. Oh, stinkers. Oh, no. I like it, though. Again, they're, they're mixing things up. They're not always doing the same thing. That was good. That was, that was excellent. I liked it. It was fair, but it was creepy and hard. And I really burned through the ammo. Oh, I get stuck, like, on their dead bodies. Oh, there we go. There wasn't any ammo hanging out in these corners, right? Okay. Is this one a chef? I think so. Alright, I feel like maybe I'm supposed to be looking for something now, but there's a switch. Let's get that first. Okay. So, switches. What does that do? Alright. I didn't see it do anything, so it probably opens up that room that I got locked into a minute ago. I don't know where that room is, but we'll follow our the right wall and find our way out. Uh, down here, maybe? No. Yes? Is this backward? No. There we go. You see an enemy? That's always a good sign. It means you're going the right way, right? Alright. How full am I on that one? Pretty full on that one, too. Nice. But, again, uh, I've even liked the, you know, ammunition kind of just dangling in different parts of the ceiling and stuff. That's been fun. Ooh, she's a 
3v1. She might have more health. It seemed like I hit her in the head. So the red one might have more health. All right, here we go. Oh, he's faster. He didn't used to be that fast. Boy. Was there a health back here? There was. Let's grab that. Okay. Again, it's it's escalating at a good pace. I feel like it's been fair and it's been interesting. It's been, I mean, enough interesting enough that I've actually had a hard time making commentary sometimes because I'm engrossed in not dying and making sure I'm doing well. Which is the sign of a good game. Alright. Oh, no. Whoa! Okay, now it's arachnophobia plus gynophobia. Got it. Ooh. Oh, man. Playing Ring Around the Rosie, but... Alright. That was a bad one on my part. Ouch, I got hit again. Ow, I'm almost dead. Ooh. You don't have very much room to for air. You gotta get around that pillar fast. I mean, this is a cheaty fight, but I don't know what else to do. Oh man, I'm out of that ammo. I feel like... Uh oh, I'm stuck. No! No! Oh no, three health. That's not good. Oh, she's stuck. Maybe I'm supposed to die? Because I don't know how I could win this battle. Ow. No, restart. There's ammo on the walls, okay? Okay. Good to see. But I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Am I shooting her bullets? If I shoot at her bullets, do I survive? Ow. Doesn't... Maybe. But I can't tell if that just wastes, I mean, bullets, and now I can't hit her. Alright, so as long as I'm shooting at her, it doesn't seem like her bullets get through, but now I'm empty, which isn't good. Alright. Uh. Does she only scream when I hit her butt? I can't tell what I'm supposed to hit. I mean, the butt is red. And, you know, the law of video games <laughs> says red things are what you shoot. Alright. Trying to get that. All right. Oh. Ow. I don't know what to do. I'm just running out of ammo. See, I'm out. There's got to be some. There we go. Some three. Oh, no. No. Give me some pistol ammo. Oh, she finally dead? Goodness gracious. Wow, that was surprisingly difficult. Alright, Mothman Horror. Sector Zero. Okay, what's next? Can I just kill this guy now? Oh, sweet! I've overcome my fear of arachnids. Now I can just step on them. Now's the doorbell gonna ring, and I've overcome my fear of girls, too, by killing one in a video game. Uh, I'm not sure that this uh, metaphor holds up, but, you know. Alright, I think that might have been the entire game. We'll see, but uh, maybe it keeps going. That's it. 
Alright, well this was, uh, I mean a long video, but a short game. I'm not sure I can recommend it per se, but that, he definitely has something here. If this guy comes out with another game, I think I would give it a try. The storyline was not excellent, but the game mechanics were all solid. And the graphics were good. Good enough, I mean, for their low-poly retro style, but I thought it was excellent. So, yeah, check out Gynophobia. A little weird, but could be good. And if you don't like this game, go find another game, because Halloween games are excellent. We only have, like, 11 more days till Halloween. Can you believe that? It's so close. It is so close, guys. All right. Till next time, I've been Sin Placebo. Take care.